What's a decap cell and why it's used in physical design? Let's understand what's a capacitor first before going to understand what's a decoupling capacitor is. A capacitor is a electrical component whose charge is proportional to its voltage. Uh, we represent it by Q is proportional to its voltage, which is V. So we introduce a constant saying Q is equal to C times V, where C becomes the capacitance of the capacitor. In other words, what we are saying is a, a capacitor can store charge. And when we are saying the charge is proportional to its voltage, uh, we are also saying that capacitor doesn't like the voltage change, right? Uh, in, in case of a DC circuit, if we place a capacitor in series with the load, then a uh, capacitor completely blocks it and it doesn't uh, allow any current to flow through after it got charged. Okay, but when we place it parallelly uh, with the load, that's uh, when it becomes much more useful in controlling the voltage across the load. Now, this is what is used uh, in case of physical design. Uh, they want to use it as reservoir of charges and uh, they don't want any fluctuations of uh, supply voltage to happen. And it's very sensitive in case of physical design that voltage fluctuations can happen. Any types of cells can switch uh, at any time, which can increase the demand of uh, instantaneous current, uh, which can drop uh, the voltage, uh, which is the supply voltage, which can cause uh, two different things called voltage droop and uh, ground bounds, which means the voltage, supply voltage can go below uh, the reference level and it can, even the uh, ground level can come up, which could cross uh, even ground bounds, uh, which can lead to chip failures, complete chip failures. And decoupling capacitors solve this problem by supplying instantaneous high demand current and they stabilize the voltage. And this is why it's very crucial to have decoupling capacitors everywhere in your design.